guys, so this is going to be another haul video. Sort of. So as you guys know, I'm going to be part of a new crafting DIY collab channel called HGTV Handmade. And the company Fiskers, which does a lot of um, like cutting tools and scissors and X-Acto knives and other cutting instruments, um, they contacted all of the girls who are going to be a part of this new channel, and they asked if they could send us free things. So of course I said yes, and then a few days ago I got four boxes in the mail, which is way more than I was expecting. It's like the most amazing haul I have ever seen in my life. I kind of can't believe that I own all of these things. I also don't know where I'm going to put them all, but um, yeah, so I just thought that to say thank you I would go through everything they sent me and show you guys all of my new crafting supplies. So the first thing is too big to even fit on this camera screen, but it is a 20, 24 by 36 uh, cutting mat, which is easily the biggest cutting mat I have ever owned. I don't even have a desk that is this big, so I'm just gonna have to use it on the floor, but it's amazing and it feels like really nice quality, so I can't wait to start cutting into it. So next I'll go through all of the big things that they sent me. They sent me the um, precision paper trimmer. It looks like that and it is just um, a paper trimmer where you put the paper in and then you pull the blade across. And I don't actually own one of these. It probably would have been very useful in college when I was cutting paper like every single day to make books, but now I still, you know, cut paper a lot so I'm sure this will come in very handy. Then they sent me this punch cartridge thing which lets you punch out um, like decorative borders and just decorative things from all the different punches and they also sent me a few of the punches so I'll get to those in a minute but yeah up here you can kind of see the different sorts of things that you can make with this um, it's really like intricate stuff so I'm really excited to try this out then they sent me this 6 by 24 inch ruler which is like the biggest ruler I have ever seen but um, I'm sure this will come in handy for cutting you know really long um, pieces of paper or like posters and using it with the giant cutting mat and also it's clear but it feels like a pretty hard plastic so I think I'll be able to cut you know directly against it without worrying about cutting into it um, and I don't have a clear ruler that I can do that with so I'm sure this will be very handy and then they sent me the rotary cutter and ruler combo which is another um, paper cutter only this one has um, this really intricate ruler um, on the on the base where you put the paper so I'm not sure what the difference is between this one and the other paper cutter. I think this one is just a lot longer and not, you know, like just a um, letter size like the other one is. So yeah, I'm gonna have to try both of these out and then give you guys an update. Okay, so those were all the big things. Now for the, the smaller things. Um, they sent me a ton of scissors. So the first one are these uh, fabric scissors which come with a protective cover so that the blades don't get gross when you're storing them. And I don't actually have fabric scissors, I just have normal scissors that I use on everything. So I'm definitely gonna keep these nice and only for fabric. They sent me this tiny little X-Acto knife. Um, well, it's an X-Acto blade and it swivels around so you can do really detailed detailed exacto knife work. Um, I didn't even know that these existed, that people made these, so I really want to try this one out and just cut really intricate paperwork. They sent me these micro tip fabric scissors, which are shaped a little bit differently from normal scissors, and apparently they help with arthritis, which I don't have, but my hand does sometimes get tired from, you know, cutting things all day, so um, yeah, I'm, I don't, I've never really seen these around, but I'm definitely going to try them out and see if they make my hand hurt less. Next, they send me a new utility knife. Um, I was going to say X-Acto knife, but I think X-Acto is just the brand for, you know, the other, the X-Acto knives. So it's basically the same thing, only a little bit bigger, and it has um, a hand grip, which is really nice because my other one is just all metal all the way down, so my hand just gets so sore and so, like, rubbed raw when I'm cutting things for like hours on end, so this is going to be amazing. More scissors, these are just um, general non-stick scissors, um, so yeah, you can always use more scissors. I think I'm gonna, these are the scissors that I use right now, so I think these will become my tape scissors because when you're cutting, you know, duct tape or other tape, it kind of builds up all the gunk on the blades, and I've tried to keep these clean, but they're getting a little bit dull, so I think these are gonna be my tape scissors, and these are going to be my paper and everyday scissors. And then there's another pair of just everyday scissors. These are a little bit smaller, so um, if I don't need to use the giant scissors, if I'm just cutting little things, I'm sure I can use these. Okay, this is something I have wanted forever. It is a rotary cutter, and I have been wanting one for ages, and for some, like in art stores and stuff, I just never seem to buy one. So that was like the first thing I asked for when they asked me what I wanted from their company. I was like, I want a rotary cutter. And they sent me one, and now I own one, and I'm getting way too excited about 
crafting supplies, but like I have been eyeing one of these for ages, so I just I'm, I I can't wait to open this up. More scissors. These are um, thick like paper and mixed media scissors, so they can cut probably like cardboard and other thicker things that would dull the blades of normal scissors. And they also have a little protective cover for the blade. And then this is basically the same thing, only it's a bigger pair of scissors, and it has a white handle instead of an orange handle, which probably means it's from a different line of craft supplies or something. Um, I basically now I have enough scissors to last me the rest of my life. Except wait, there's more! And one, I, th I think this is my last pair of scissors, um, but it's a like oversized um, fabric scissors. It's like a giant, actually these are really comfortable, like my hand fits perfectly into this thing. Um, so yeah, it's another pair of fabric scissors, only they're bigger, so you, I guess you can make longer cuts so it stays straighter all the way down. Moving on, the rest of the stuff they sent me are paper punches. So this is a hexagon paper punch, so if I ever wanted to cut a hexagon that is two inches in diameter. Now I can cut unlimited hexagons. And they actually sent me two of those. I'm not sure why. Um, I think, as far as I can tell, it's the same thing. So I'll have to look at that a bit closer and see if it's the same thing or not. Um, I don't think I'll need two, so maybe I can do a giveaway. Um, I'm not doing a giveaway yet. I'm gonna look into it more and see how it works so I can make sure I can actually like recommend it to you properly. But yeah, maybe in the future. Let me know if this is something you might want. Okay, more paper punches. This one is kind of an intricate circle design, which you can use to make, you know, decorative borders or just punch out a bunch of circles that look like that. And then this is basically the same thing, only it's a flower instead of circles. Oh, this one is another thing that I have been wanting forever and I just didn't know, you know, what the best version of it to buy is, but um, this is a corner rounder and actually has three different sizes all in one tool. You can see them here. And so you just stick your paper into the side and then you squeeze the things and then it gives you a perfectly rounded corner and I always just cut mine by hand and then they all come out uneven and I'm just adjusting them until it just looks terrible and I'm ruining everything. So I'm really like way too excited about this tool. Okay, so this is um, the cartridge for that um, decorative paper cutter that I showed you earlier and it has these like chevrons and then these polka dots between them I don't know that yeah, you can see that one a lot better but yeah that's the pattern um, so I'll be enough to try this out and see how it how it works and then one more cartridge and this one is more of a flowery like um, petal design so yeah that's everything that they sent me which is way too generous it was way too much stuff like it's amazing, and I they're such high quality tools. I really can't wait to start crafting using these, and everything I make is just gonna be cut so much more cleanly. And yeah, thank you so much to Fiskers for sending me all this stuff. It was really amazing. And um, I'm, so the reason they sent it to me once more, one more time is for the HGTV Handmade channel, which I'll link right down below so that you can subscribe to it and also probably in an annotation somewhere around here. So I'm doing crafting videos over there and I'm sure I'm gonna use all of these tools at some point throughout the year on those videos. So make sure you go subscribe to that channel. So if you want to see more new things that I got, which like this stuff doesn't even fit in my room, I have to like, rearrange everything. I don't even know where I'm gonna put it all, but um, if you want to see all the presents that I got for Christmas and my birthday... Oh, another thing, all this stuff arrived on my birthday, so it was like the best unintentional birthday present ever. Uh, but if you want to see all of the actual presents that I got for Christmas and my birthday, I made another video going through all of those. You can watch that right here. And um, normally I would walk off screen, but I'm kind of surrounded down here by crafting supplies, so... I'm just gonna end the video now, but thank you guys for watching, and I will see you all next time.